Many people ask me why Puerto Rico by GPS is in English. After all, the native tongue in Puerto Rico is Spanish. What's more, less than 20% of Puerto Ricans can be classified as fully bilingual. And that's not my opinion. It's the latest data from the U.S. Census Bureau. The same data also shows that as you move away from San Juan, the percentage of fully bilingual people decreases. So why is Puerto Rico by GPS in English? Simple. It's not for Puerto Ricans. And I don't mean to be facetious or mean, but there are plenty of excellent sites in Spanish, and in that scenario, mine would be just another one. But there's an even more powerful reason. You see, when someone from one town on the island visits another town and spends, I don't know, let's say $1,000, the destination town becomes $1,000 richer and his own town becomes $1,000 poorer. But what's more important is that Puerto Rico as a whole doesn't add a single penny to its GDP. Of course, some will say that those $1,000 circulate in the destination town's economy and generate a multiplier effect. But the same thing would have happened if the money would have stayed in his own town. Hence, the only way for Puerto Rico to move the needle, so to say, is to attract tourists from outside the island. And statistics show that most of those tourists arrive from the U.S. and Canada. The mission at Puerto Rico by GPS is to attract English-speaking tourists. And those people hardly speak any Spanish. So that's why the site is in English. I guess it could also be bilingual if the same people that criticized would put up the money to translate the site, but I won't hold my breath. So while I have your attention, take a minute to comment, subscribe, and enjoy a couple of videos. <laughs> oh, and welcome to Puerto Rico by GPS.